Well, it's the 1st of March and there's all kinds of stuff going on. More and more political campaign commercials. And a food test! Please excuse the crappy lighting that I have. I have a really bright light over here and a not so bright kind of light over there and then the light over the desk which is whatever yeah well it's a dull day today it was dull and my back hurt like crazy it's almost like my back stiffened up and I couldn't bend any which way because it hurts really bad well anyway I've been doing some thinking about cleaning the house next door and, you know, I'm kind of skittish about ghosts and stuff, too. So I asked my good friend, Rebecca Tompkins, is there something I could do, do you think, you know, to purify it or make sure that if there's a spirit there that they don't bother me when I'm cleaning the house? She gave me some suggestions. Thank you, Rebecca. And, uh... Yeah, I didn't get a whole lot done today because of my back and my neck. And I just, pretty soon, I didn't change a calendar yet, but pretty soon I'll be going to a clinic. I think it's next week, so hopefully I'll find out what the heck's going on. But now, it's time for a taste test. I changed the calendar and I go to the clinic next Wednesday. Not, not tomorrow, but a week from tomorrow. And then there's an election day on the 15th, which I'll be working, and the week after that, AARP representative is going to help me with my taxes. So, and then comes um, St. Patrick's Day is in this month. So it's kind of a busy month, and hopefully the weather will get better, and we'll be able to do more stuff outside. It'll be more fun. But now, I saw these on television commercials, and they look interesting. And I know my son Brian loves mint cookies, like the Girl Scout Thin Mints. Anything chocolate mint he loves. So I thought, this is my excuse for buying them, okay? I will buy these, and I will try them, and if they are good, I will say to Brian, you must get these, they are good. But I don't know if they are yet. These are Oreo, and I love Oreos. It's one of the few store-bought cookies that I really actually like. Oreo, thin with mint inside and the thin which means the stuffing part in the filling I don't know if you can see it can y'all see them? they are kinda thin they are quite thin actually can you think? <laughs> they are very thin shall I try it with or without tea first? I think I'll try it plain Usually, especially with Oreos, I dunk them in coffee. But I have a nice cup of tea here. Let's try it by itself first. Wow, that's very thin. Mmm, <laughs> I like. Now we're going to dunk it. Not too long or it falls off in your brew. Right, Peter K? Hmm. We have a winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Hmm. Let's go. Now the hard part is how long can I make these last? Will they be eaten in one go? Or two goes? Or will I be a good girl and they'll last for a, lot, a long time? I doubt that. <laughs> I'm a good person, but being a good girl, mmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yes, indeed, very good. Well, tomorrow's Whoop Whoop Wednesday, and I will have a joke for you. Mmm, back to the Oreos. <laughs> Upward and onward.